Well, I think I'm gonna get me a little rum in here because I always wanted me a little soup. And the question here is, will Ronald Dick Chopper, Barry Perlman, and Lorena Bobbitt Escobar get mad at these transgressions here of going to a restaurant, my kind going to a restaurant, and eating food of other cultures? Or will they continue with their planetary operations trying to make me look like a manic depressive OCD, violent paranoid schizo, and try to get me to hurt myself or others for this next heinous crime of eating din din, paying off LAPD, the judicial system, to mentally rape and have his five years old killed with worldwide support now, especially after finding out at 29 what was going on, because I might date someone my family doesn't approve of. That crime, that crime, right? Like A. John Oliveira's, or stick my dick in some gay guy's asshole who tries to force himself on me in 1993 with worldwide gay groups trying to kill me over it for the crime of saying I'm not interested. Um, the very things that LAPD and the judicial system don't want coming to light with Dr. Dick Chopper, Barry Perlman, and Lorena Bobbitt Escobar. Well, my father wanted me to work in his office for 14 years after the Mike Huntley death threats and mentally bludgeoned my skull in with those groups and worldwide support. Did LAPD does not think is wrong because they're here to protect and serve. That's why they're running around trying to chop people's fucking dicks off after paying off people to take them to strip clubs and say, you associated with those people. Now the real question here is why don't those people think that that's wrong? like everyone else or why do we have half the black community hunting me to kill me since eight years old for kissing a black girl showing that they're uncle tom's to the dick choppers with their no relaxing for you nigger campaign these are all public issues that we need to all discuss publicly not not secret illuminati bullshit but public a planet was contacted to kill me from a child rapist father Let's talk about it. Why would they help? Why would they believe a sick child rapist father? Now remember this, one more thing. 2000 and about two, Dr. Susan Donner stating, they think you're a schizophrenic. They, who is they? With uh, Dr. Dick Chopper, Barry Perlman, who is they? Running around trying to make me look like a violent paranoid schizo saying they think I'm a schizophrenic because I didn't know there's a they to the equation here when you're out trying to live your life and you live in Oregon and you live in um, Colorado and you live. So they, federally they, hunting me with Dick Dr. or Dick Chopper Barry Perlman, Dr. Dick Chopper Barry Perlman and Lorena, Lorena Bobbitt Escobar paid off to do what? Paid off to do what? Like several LAPD police officers starting at a very young age. Paid off to do what? Try to rile someone up with the No Relaxing For You nigger campaign to hurt themselves or others, correct? Wait a minute. What does that have to do with mental illness? Other than using mental illness to kill. Using your secondary psychology degree to kill someone you don't like or exterminate or eradicate someone you don't like. Why is the judicial system taking part in these types of horrific, unspeakable crimes to hurt, harm, maim, and try to kill people? Or, or try to maim them or whatever, okay? Why would they even take one second out of their day to even consider the notion and not arrest the guy approaching him saying here's money my son's crazy i want you to make him look crazy my son's crazy i want you to make him look crazy i don't know I, i'm i'm a sort of hung on that one right there my son's crazy you need to make him look crazy to eradicate him well if i'm crazy you don't need to make me look crazy that's the point 
Anyways, I'm gonna go eat some ramen and um, some pho, cause all I ever wanted was some soup. And not Benny's soup. <laughs>